Okay, so here I've got my barn door third brake lights. I uh, can't remember how much both of them now, but they're not expensive. Eighteen pound for a VW T5. So I'm going to um, go and see how we fit these right now. So, in order to remove the star bolts, we need to use a size T20. Okay, and that will that will remove the bolt from the back of the third brake light. Nice, nice and easy. Just come straight out. Okay, so it's a little fiddly getting the old light out. Uh, I can't remember where I put it now. Um, you can see through here, that to actually take the door lock off and uh, through the hole there. I managed to just give it a little tap because it's been on there for so long. I had to give it a tap um, to get it out. You can see that's what it looks like from the front. This is the new light. And the clip on the back, literally just, just a simple clip, just clips straight back in. Alright, so we're going to fit that, and I'll show you what that looks like when that's um, put back in. So I don't know if you can see all the all this black dirt and grime around the edge. I'm going to give that a good clean up, so that's nice and clean. So I'm just going to use some soapy water and cloth. Very sunny day today. Oh, we're just locked again. So, here's the old one. Just come out your cigarette, it's all, it was broken beforehand and cracked, which is why I'm replacing it. Um, and that's underneath the old one, so it comes out nice and easy. And then we can obviously the new one in here. To go on the other side. Yeah, so fit that in, put the little waterproof gusset around the outside, and push that right over. All you have to do now is screw those two screws back in, and that's that light done. Okay, screw back in. All nice and tight. And we'll do exactly the same on the other side with the other light. So that's both, both the old lights removed. This is the other side, still fairly well intact. Um, no cracks in that one. But obviously, uh, I can't just replace one side. So we'll put the other one on. The black, um, smoky black ones, LEDs look much nicer anyway. All right, so that's that. All I need to do, obviously, same as the other side, you have to fit the little waterproof gusset that goes around the outside. So that just comes off there like that. And then it's got a sticky side, so we take the sticky wrap off, pop that over, stick it onto the light, screw it in, pop the little clip in there, clean the door, and we're all done. Uh, there we okay. go. I don't know if you can see it. Little gusset, that's all stuck on there, nice and tight. Just to keep the water out and to stop it damaging the door, obviously. Okay, so now we'll go and uh, whoop, clip that on, pop the clip in, clean the door, and so that's it. You can see we have cleaned all around that edge, so that's all. Nice and clean now, no black grimy dirt for the new light to go in. Done. That's it. All done. Yeah, okay. <laughs>